I fucking knew it. Infection. Jack Tony's gotten sick from infection. It's in his right leg. Jack. You need to tend to this infection, Jack. What are you doing? No. Here. Use the good medicine, Jack. Knowing my luck, it's going to be a real bad infection. Yeah, look at that infection. It's rising really fast. He's going to need that Glitter World medicine. Sappy's in a daze, we know. Jack Tony's got another infection. In his... In his toe? Oh, Jack. This is not good. You just need a fucking... Chill out, Jack. Stop trying to feed the animals and shit. He's damn determined. Oh, now he's just kind of relaxing. That's good. Jack Tony's about to have a major break risk. What do you need? Do you need to smoke some dubs? Do we have any dubs for you to smoke? Smoke a dube. There you go, Jack. Selling something. What are we selling to them? They want eight pairs of pants. Okay. Uh, and they'll give us Luciferium. Yeah, we could use some Luciferium. So they just want pants? They're just like eight pairs of pants? We might be able to do that. And where's this place? Ooh, that's pretty far away. That would be quite the trip. I don't know if I want to do all that. Oh, they're throwing a party. Everybody come to the party. Smoking dubs. <laughs> Talking about maids and androids and wishing they still had television. Everybody's having a great time. Trozma chatted. Hold on. Chatted about sports with Daro. And Trozma had a word about beautiful people to Jack Tony. So she had a word about beautiful people this time. She wasn't making a joke about beautiful people. Made a comment about short people. All right, Jack, that's... You, you sure like to comment about short people, Jack. Sella loudly insulted Sheckley's loyalty. Sheckley's loyalty about what? Jack Tony talked about backgammon with Sheckley. Uh, what is Sheckley... Sheckley... Said something about Hull chat about making jackets. Why are you questioning her loyalty? Sheckley and Trozma Tony chatted about food. Why are you questioning her loyalty? Sheckley has been here for a long time. Is Sheckley not loyal? I mean... Her cult-mindedness is zero percent. Does that mean she doesn't believe in the cult anymore? <gasps> Trozma's is zero percent. So is Hull's. But so is Sela's. We really need to get some more... We need to do something. We need to do something involving the cult stuff. I know we need batteries, but... This cult is... It's gotta get researched. Alright, so we finished researching the Cypher Strain symbols. Decipher some of the 
materials, language to make further research possible. Okay. So I think next we want. I think next we want the altar. Oh well, we have a crash-landed person named Barbara. We can either rescue her or capture her. Hmm. I'm gonna say capture. If only because I don't know that we want Barbara. But we probably will just let Barbara go. Even though it's not going to give us anything. Because everybody's a bunch of pansies, and they, they don't want to... Well, you know, they don't want to get their hands dirty, Jack. They don't want to harvest organs. You're going to take her clothes. Do that real quick. Before she dies. All right, the altar allows the creation of an altar to worship, uh, to conduct rituals for beings beyond this world. Okay. So, should we research the altar sacrifice, or perhaps probe occult deities? We can discover deities to worship. That sounds pretty useful. All right, we'll do that. Oh no, the poison. The poison's finally... Sappy needs help. But the poison uh, ship is finally starting to encroach on us. Hmm. I need you guys to harvest this while we can. And I guess we'll just have to keep building uh, growing zones out here. I would give them some variety, but the rice grows the fastest. So, lots of rice. Make a big old <laughs> rice field out here. And it seems like we got some visitors from the uh, Great Empire. And the mechanoids don't give a shit. That's nice. There's only three of them anyway, so I suppose... Uh, I suppose they wouldn't have been too much help. Alright. Is it still uh, Sheckley? Yeah, Sheckley's still the best at it. Alright, Sheckley. Why don't you go trade? Let's see what they got for sale here. Uh, nothing too crazy. They don't want to buy Barbara either. Yeah, right. So we decided to gift them a bunch of stuff to raise our uh, goodwill with them. Might as well. It wasn't quite enough to make them allies. Maybe we should. Because we only really needed... Uh, oh. Not what I wanted to do at all. But we only really needed, uh, like, four more. Could Sheckley potentially get us that four more with the Ambrosia? How much will you like us if we give you Ambrosia? Well, yes. Yes, we could. All right, I want to do that. All right, so we're going to give them... Ambrosia, and now we are allied with them. So hopefully when it, the time comes to actually fight this thing, our allies will come and help us out. That's the hope anyway. Oh, so Sappy's not having a good time. Should we just let Barbara go? I don't really have any use for Barbara.
We get no relation if we let you go. Oh, sappy. Somebody go strip sappy. We get no relation for letting sappy go either. Oh, well. Just, just fucking, just let Barbara go. Bye, Barbara. Have a good life. I don't know, whatever. And as for Sappy, Sappy's an enemy combatant. And we aren't going to get any kind of, well, anything for keeping her alive. Entity discovered? What? Research finished, probe occult deity. Oh, okay. Well, we'll check that out in a second. Let's see what we want to get here. Hmm. We really need batteries. Although maybe solar power might be good, but we need the batteries more, I think. So we'll have her research that. All right, let's see what entity. Uh, Tazaguath was discovered amongst these strange symbols. Title, uh, Sleeper of Nikai, the Sleeping God, the Toad God. Domains, caverns, sloth, gluttony, sleep, formless spawn. Description, in the cave, uh, in the secret cave, in the bowels of Vormid something, abides from eldermost eons, the god Taskagaska. And you shall know him by his great girth and his bat-like furriness. And the like, uh, the look of a sleepy black toad, which he has eternally. Uh, he will rise not from his place, even in the ravings of hunger, but will wait in divine slothfulness for the sacrifice. Okay. The sleeper of Nakai carries out his will through his cultist servants and formless spawn, whilst uh, he rests in divine slothfulness. Can make deals with mortals on occasions during these rare opportunities. Mortals can acquire his ichor and gain effortless power. Uh, do we want to worship this deity? Is that a is that a good idea? Now, why were we not able to sell that? I guess they didn't want it. Is it tainted? Oh. Uh, okay. Well, we got some more visitors, Jack. These ones are from Luwe. And again, the robots don't seem to give a shit. All right, that's that's great. We're uh, doing some renovations here. Moving some uh, wires around to make the room look better. Uh, we should probably have the wires... Actually, we just go across like that. We don't even need this. Yeah, okay. Let's take those wires down. Let's swap them out. Hello, I don't suppose you guys want to kill those robots. That'd be, that'd be super helpful if you were to kill those robots. Alright, so much like uh, the other ones, Lue, we're going to see if we can give them gifts. I highly doubt we'll be able to get to 75 with what we got. But we do have a lot of cloth. Which will give us a little bit of a boost with them. And we could give them Ambrosia. Which gets up to 51. We don't really need all this ambrosia, to be fair. Yeah. Get us up to 50 with them. Well, let's hope that was for the best. I know we're about to enter an extreme famine because of this stupid thing, and we just gave them all our ambrosia, but there's like a whole bunch of other ambrosia plants out here, so maybe it'll be fine. Oh, these ones are dying. Never mind. There's not as many out here as I thought there was, Jack. Jack, you never, uh, you never equipped your shotgun. What? 
bio-coated shotgun. Where's your shotgun, Jack? Oh, there it is. I was I was a little worried there, Jack. I fucking bio-coated shotgun. What kind of useless shit is that? Sappy. Oh my god. Sappy. Can somebody just get rid of her? Can we just can we just let her go? I don't even care anymore. Just just let her go. Oh, it's her planetarium addiction, right? Well, she's probably gonna die. Nothing that can be done about it. She's just screwed. I mean, she was an enemy combatant anyway, so who cares? Fucking try to kill us. Should we research IEDs? We can't even. No, we don't need IEDs yet. We need, uh. If we research mortars, we might be able to get mortar shells. But, at the same time. I'm sure there's plenty of other things that would be equally as useful, like pemmican, for example. Uh, it'd be very handy to be able to make pemmican. Or even the packaged survival meals, really. Um, but... If we had geothermal power... We'll research the mortars... Even though we don't have chem fuel, really, to make them. Also, I'm wanna, I want to do a test here. If I build an indoor area, will it keep them, uh, the plants safe from this thing going on here? If that's the case, we'll be able to grow uh, more food. There's a mad rat. Of course, there's a mad rat. What are you so mad about, Mr. Rat? You've only a two-year-old rat. Why are you throwing your life away? You're climbing all the way upstream? Yeah, that's right. That's right, asshole. You gonna swim all the way upstream just to get to our camp? Just to get to our home? I don't think so. <laughs> this might not keep enemies out, but it can sure be a pain in the ass for them. Well, I guess this mad rat just lives out here now. Oh. No, it's it's figuring it out. Okay. No, no, no. There we go. Oh, and it's dead. All right. Good uh good attempt. Thanks for wasting my trap. Oh boy. Oh. There's just Okay. Well, well, Jack. Um, that, that scared me for a second there. I was very concerned by all these alerts, but it's okay. It doesn't actually matter. Okay. Okay. So, one of our maids gave birth, and then immediately... Yeah, look at the adorable little kittens, but immediately we were attacked by pack of manhunting boom rat oh my god oh ho 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 <laughs> oh no what the fuck okay holy shit Um... Huh. Well, the hope is that they're coming around and they'll hit some of these traps, but I doubt they'll hit all the traps. Wow. Okay. Um... Hmm. Well, everybody. Time to 
Get ready. Sheckley and Hull. And good old Sela. Get over here, Sela. Everybody get in position. Oh boy. Alright, that's a stab. Wow, that's a lot of them. I can't even. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21 of them, maybe. Oh, here they come. Oh, oh no. Why was that baby? Oh no. It got blown up. Why were you out there? Why were... All right. Okay. The Tonys for sure need to pull back. Sheckley. Go that way. Hull and Sela. Okay. All right. Mm. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead. Get to the fucking animal safety zone, you stupid babies. You stupid children. All right. Made Nuku. Go to Jack Tony. All right. Somebody's getting fucked here. Hmm. Run away. <clears throat> Everybody. Everybody run away. Oh, man. Oh, no. Hull, Sela. Most importantly, the Tonys need to be safe. Oh, no. Hull, you need to, you need to book it. Oh, Sela. Oh, poor Sela. All right, Hull. Here they come. Sela, no! Sela! Alright, the Tonys are in danger. The Tonys are in severe danger. They need to evacuate. Evacuate! Oh, 
Oh, Sela. Trozma. Trozma. God damn it, Trozma. Get in, Trozma. Hurry. Trozma, I swear to God. Alright, this is horrible. Oh. Oh no. Jack. Sela. Alright. This motherfucker. I think that's all of them. <gasps> Sela! Sela, you got back up! Oh, and you're trying to beat out the fire. You can't, you can't tend to yourself. Oh, man. Sheckley? I forgot you were over there. You're the only one that's not fucked up. Wow. It's damn boom rats. Trying to fucking kill us. It's all this food. Our wealth has probably skyrocketed. Oh, yeah. Oh, it, the wealth is just... Alright, yeah. That's gonna be a problem. We're gonna get raided and just destroyed.